everybody. Um, I got a coil here and uh, a bridge, rectifying bridge, and uh, that is connected to this capacitor. And I'm measuring the voltage in the capacitor. Now, if this wheel is turning, or I got magnets on the wheel, it won't charge the capacitor, at least not when it's running this slow. The capacitor is uh, losing, it's uh, leaking. But if I connect this coil in parallel with this coil and do, do it with a read switch and I put it here, look what happens. I don't have to go fast at all and I will charge the capacitor. Um, let's see, if I do it like this, it will do even better. It will go about 12 volts. I don't know how far it will go, but uh, definitely above 12. Let's go a little bit faster. Quite interesting. And now, if I remove this, so this coil will not be connected at, no, at any time, it will drop. I put the switch here, it will get charged. Uh, this is how far it will get without the read switch and the extra coil. And you can see it's, it's, uh, it's even dropping now. And uh, if I put the read switch here, climbing quite fast. And I managed to push it up to 75 volts. Thank you for watching.